James Buchanan, the 15th President of the United States. He served as President from 1857 to 1861. Born in Pennsylvania, 1791, Buchanan had a long and distinguished political career, serving as a U.S. Representative, U.S. Senator, Secretary of State, and Minister to the United Kingdom. Buchanan's presidency was marked by economic turmoil, including a severe financial crisis known as the Panic of 1857. The crisis led to widespread unemployment, with workers experiencing wage reductions or losing their jobs altogether. Many businesses faced bankruptcies, resulting in job losses and economic hardships. Buchanan confronted tensions with the Mormons in Utah, leading to the controversial Utah War. Buchanan struggled to prevent the secession of southern states, and his presidency witnessed the secession of several states, ultimately leading to the breakup of North and South. Buchanan's presidency is often viewed as one of the least successful in American history. James Buchanan, the Forgotten President Franklin Pierce, the 14th President of the United States, held office from 1853 to 1857. Born in 1804 in New Hampshire, Pierce served as a brigadier general in the Mexican-American War. Pierce fought in the war and was praised for his bravery and leadership. Under Pierce's administration, the United States acquired land from Mexico known as the Gadsden Purchase, which aimed to facilitate the construction of a transcontinental railroad. Pierce's presidency witnessed the highly controversial Dred Scott decision by the Supreme Court, which deepened the divisions over slavery. Pierce signed the Kansas-Nebraska Act in 1854, which allowed for popular sovereignty in determining the status of slavery in the territories. Pierce's presidency is often viewed as one marked by the issue of slavery, ultimately leading to the outbreak of the American Civil War. After leaving office, Pierce retired from politics and returned to his law practice in New Hampshire. Franklin Pierce, The Gadsden Purchase Millard Fillmore, the 13th President of the United States Born in New York in 1800, he served as president from 1850 to 1853. Fillmore played a crucial role in brokering the Compromise of 1850, which maintained the balance between free and slave states, lowering tensions between the North and South. While controversial, Fillmore actively enforced the Fugitive Slave Act, which aimed to capture and return escaped slaves to their owners. Fillmore supported the establishment of public schools, helping to promote accessible education for all. He opened diplomatic relations with Japan through the Treaty of Kanagawa. The Whig Party faced internal divisions and eventual dissolution in 1856 due to the passage of the Kansas-Nebraska Act in 1854. This controversial act permitted the expansion of slavery in the territories and created significant rifts within the party. Despite its relatively brief existence, the Whig Party exerted a profound influence on American politics. Millard Fillmore, The Last Whig. Thank you for watching. Subscribe now at American Presidential History. Stay updated with the latest videos. Follow at American Presidential History for more content and shorts. Like, share, and support the channel's growth. Subscribe now. www.youtube.com American Presidential H History Welcome to American Presidential History. Dive into the captivating world of U.S. presidents through engaging stories that bring their lives, legacies, and the times they lived in vividly to life.